You're watching News Channel 18 This Morning. News from where you live. 626 on the clock right now and with summer comes the outdoor grilling and picnic seasons and a lot of family reunions probably coming up. Yeah. A lot of people are looking for some good recipes and anyone with kids knows it's hard to keep things healthy and easy and convenient at the same time. Well, dietitian Anna Gusenberg with Franciscan St. Elizabeth Health is here this morning to share some really unique recipes and I love some of these. They're quick and easy yes. and healthy. So let's talk a little bit about the recipes first. Which one do you want to start with? Let's start with the sandwiches. Okay. Uh, kids love sandwiches. Mm -hmm. And these are fun to make. I've gotten some fun, creative cookie cutters here, and then simply took a slice of bread and cut out different shapes. And then I have the ingredients that I put in each of these sandwiches. Um, so we have the bread, and then we made mm -hmm. just a meat and cheese sandwich. And the cucumbers. Yes, Easy enough. and cucumbers for a vegetable coupled with a vegetable green um, cream cheese. So I thought that would be kind of a fun, different type mm -hmm. of sandwich. It would be. It's really easy to make. The kids can help cut out the bread as well as the cheese shapes, and then you can easily pack it up and take it with you on a picnic. Definitely easy for anywhere. Snacks, mm -hmm. quick trip to the park maybe. Yeah. yeah. Well, then I love the yogurt pops. Yes. Talk about this those. is super easy. Um, these would definitely be for a. Uh, older kid, if you mm -hmm. had a younger one, maybe going for a four ounce size yeah. might be a good alternative. <laughs> it's a healthy serving of yogurt. <laughs> yeah, um, but you simply cut a slit in the top, insert a popsicle stick, and freeze it. It's wow. that simple. And then I put these in last night, and they were frozen this morning. Great. So it's that easy. You can just rip off the top and take it along yeah, with you. Yeah, exactly. And the fruit looks delicious, especially with the little chocolate on there. Yes, too. I thought that might be a nice little additive um, yeah. to help entice your kids to eat their fruit. Um, so again, for an older kid, they can help um, cut up the fruit and put it on the kebab. Bob. For you know a younger kid, maybe I'd use a different type of stick so that they mm -hmm. wouldn't poke themselves or hurt themselves. But simply put the fruit on the kebab stick and then drizzle this uh, ice cream chocolate that hardens when it's cold. Okay. So I had the fruit freshly pulled out of the refrigerator so it was cold and then I drizzled the chocolate on it and it uh, turned hard and looks great and I hear it tastes delicious too. It looks delicious. Well, all these recipes we've posted online, they're on our homepage right now. I believe it's the third story on WLFI.com so you can check those out. You can also get these recipes coming up tomorrow mm -hmm. at the Healthy Families Fun Fair. And this is yes. the second year for this event and you're going to be there. You guys yeah. have a booth set up. We have a, a big nutrition it. booth and so we're going to actually focus on gardening because okay. we wanted to come up with a creative way to get kids to eat their vegetables and so we wanted to focus on gardening. So we'll have seeds and kids get to plant them themselves and we have some wonderful handouts with these recipes and some others, wonderful. as well as gardening tips for families to get out there and plant their own their own garden this summer. Yeah, and we mentioned this earlier in the week too. The Healthy Families Fun Fair is all about leading an active, healthy lifestyle. A lot of great information, some car seat checks and yeah. some free bike helmets and things. So a NICU reunion as well. So it should be a pretty fun day if you have the time to get out free admission yes. as well. So a great Everyone. excuse to take the kids out and, and pick up some recipes and some helpful information as well. Yeah. Well, Anna, thanks again for being here this Thank morning. You. We appreciate it, and we will be right back.